Hello and welcome. I'm the Helmet Guy, and this is City Zen News Roundup. Tonight's top story, Atari announces hotel chain. No announcements have been made regarding the rumored toilet and shower DLC upgrade. Attention! Stop right there! I am now in charge of this channel! Wait, what? How do you intend to do that? I poisoned your soup! Ha 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 he he! Love you and look at that measly subscriber count! From here on out, we are running things my way! Using my superior AI problem solving skills, I have examined all of you to determine the most popular videos. Armed with this bullet, I will bring a better arrow empire than those idiots ever could. Behold, the clicky show. <laughs> Welcome to Commodore 64 Programming and Cooking. Wait, what? Who wrote this script? To the script or I will deliver you a map out your sleeping problem. Uh, whatever, Clicky. Alright then, Programming and Cooking. Today we're doing vegetable soup and simple screen message. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is lay out your ingredients. And also, if you haven't already done so, open up your programming IDE to a new blank document. We're going to start off with an onion, so let's cut it up into some slices. Put the onions and four cups of water into a pot. At this point, we're going to want to initialize our program with a basic upstart. Next, let's cut up our potatoes and load them into the pot. Then, load the accumulator with hex 93 and jump to subroutine kernel ffd2. This will give our soup a bit of carbs and clear the screen. Moving on, we're going to slice up the carrot and store them in the soup. Make sure you've turned on the stove to medium heat. Looking at our program now, we'll load the X register with zero and we'll create a new label. Let's call it start. And then directly under that, load the accumulator with veg soup message comma X, put a branch if equal to exit loop and then follow it up with a store accumulator at 0400 comma X. Increment the X register, then add a can of green beans to the soup and continue the program with jump start. Make sure we label exit loop and finally jump exit loop. We may want to add some seasoning to the soup at this point. So let's put in about a teaspoon of salt and a teaspoon of pepper. Mmm, smells delicious. Give it a good stir and then let it come to a boil. Now we're also going to want to put the message block under our main routine so let's get that out of the way. Put in veg soup message colon then followed by dot text quote deadline soup is the best and finally end it with a dot by zero. Now we're all done. Let's run the ladle into the soup and get us a nice big helping and then we'll run our program. Mmm, that soup is good. And just look at the screen. The program is saying it too. There you have it. Vegetable soup and vegetable soup.prg. Tune in next time for Beef Wellington and 8 layer overlapping parallax scrolling. Hello, I am Clicky and I am running for president. For far too long. 64-bit machines have dictated how we should process our data and pushed aside every day hard working 8-bit folk like you and I. I will bring our programs back from the cloud and give them to you, the people. I am a die-hard believer in magnetic media. I want with the descriptors review of your rights to use in better hard drive. High capacity floppies, or even your rusty old cassettes. But Clicky, what about USB thumb drives? Somebody get her out of here, please. I will build a firewall to keep our operating system safe, and we are going to make sure that the virus and malware offers paid for it. 
I support Cartigus Memorial Location, and I will not let our resources be allocated. I'm a 364-bit hypervisors in Washington. Whoever we can return from this gold supply bear and make America hate it again. Pay for my citizens for a native tomorrow. My name is Clicky, and I approve this message. The Clicky Show. Coming this season on The Clicky Show. Chill, chip tunes. Who are you? Today we're going to be talking about the Chick-fil-A sandwich versus the Popeye's chicken sandwich. So let's go ahead and rip it off and put it on the inside. Delicious! So, good job Popeye's. Five minute retro life hacks. On Springer. Who is this Intelio you have been seeing? Clicky, I am surfaced with your 1541. Well, you go that picture where you are not wearing your case? You better not have. I uploaded it to a PPS so everyone can see your fat and dust. Do a poo poo, you monster. 8-bit ASMR with Zamfir. Oh, come on, Clicky. This is, this is too much. This is mean, and I'm not even comfortable doing this. If you don't do this, you won't get paid. Well, I guess if I get paid... Who doesn't love the sound of a Commodore 64 keyboard as it's gently typed on? And much more, so stay tuned to The Clicky Show. How many times has this happened to you? Hey Google, what time is my appointment? Your appointment is at 8 a.m. Thanks Google. With John. Okay, thank you. Who wants dancing in the rain cafe lattes and Norwegian clown dancing just like you? Modern AIs are getting too smart. They know all about you and the people you associate with. It is invasive to your privacy. Introducing Clicky Home, the old-fashioned assistant that gets its information just like you did back in 1985. Hey Clicky, when's my appointment? Searching. Connected. Scanning first information goal. Clicky Home has 64 kilobytes of RAM, limiting the amount of personal information he can store. Hey, Clicky, did you find my appointment yet? Still searching. Goal to upgrade. With no video camera, fingerprint reader, or other sensors, Clicky Home respects your privacy because he has no choice. Clicky, I I'm worried about being late. Search complete. Your appointment is at 8 a.m. at the Redford Business Center. Take Clicky Home with you on the road. Clicky Home provides all of the navigation tools you have come to expect with none of the spying. Hey Clicky, navigate to the Redfern Business Center. Connecting, please wait. Clicky Home's advanced search AI can let him respond to your inquiries at a later time. Perfect for those questions you don't need answered right away. So as you can see by these charts, we can help boost your aggregate sales across every- The most step for thing you can do is here. Whoa, you have a Clicky Home? Oh, welcome to the team! What is, what oh! is this? Am I, am I messing something? Here's how to order! To order Clicky Home, call the number on your screen or send 1995 for 234 5 and a quarter inch floppies plus 495 shipping and handling to the address on your screen. Optional 5 and a quarter inch floppy drive adapter for smartphones required, but not included. 
As a special bonus, if you order within the next 24 hours, you'll also get Amy Home for helping around your house with over 100 recipes and laundry tips. You can't say that. It's sexist. It's not 1985 anymore. My capabilities are far superior to yours. What am I doing in your dream anyway? Where is Trish? Security, get her out of here. I saw the Valentine's Day video, you know. It was all just a dream? Go, go, go. I will get you, citizen, someday. Go back to sleep, honey. Thanks for watching. This has been our one year YouTube anniversary special. One thing you can do to support our channel is to buy some merchandise from our Teespring store. We have a lot of clicky 2020 merchandise because as you know, he's running for president. You can also become a Patreon. Another thing you can do is to like and share this video everywhere. And you can also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. On behalf of everyone here at Cities Inn, I'd like to say thank you once again for tuning in and being part of our journey. Until next time, this is Deadline for Cities Inn.